As we move closer to the round two interviews, Mars One has announced that there are now 705 candidates remaining in the selection process. 353 people are now no longer being considered after either not passing the medicals or dropping out for personal reasons. Of the remaining candidates, most are located in the Americas, followed by Europe, Asia, Africa and Oceania. And the ratio between males and females has now become more skewed to the male side, currently standing at 60-40. Moving forward, we'll be hearing back in the near future about where and when our interviews with the regional selection committees will be taking place. And it's a complicated process because the candidates are literally scattered all over the world and Mars One is still in the process of negotiating the specific media arrangements in each country for televising the interviews. In the case of Europe, there are 187 candidates in the selection process, which are going to be divided into four roughly equally spaced regions, Northern, Eastern, Southern and Western Europe. And the UK, for example, has 23 candidates, which is the most of any country in Western Europe. So I think it most likely that the UK will be put together with Scandinavia in the Northern Europe region, as Germany, France and Spain all put together have sufficient candidates that if the UK was to be put together with them, the Western Europe region would be far too overcrowded. Now I do have to admit that there probably won't be any new videos in this channel until around late June as exam season is rapidly approaching here in Oxford. But that being said, I would love to hear any new suggestions you have for any new video topics. I've currently got ones in the works on astronaut training, dealing with radiation, terraforming, and a basic series on rocket science and the physics behind it. And that being said though, if there are any new major developments, I'll be sure to keep you updated.